category yeah i think it's category yeah so our category controller right so just like we did for the previous ones do uh php artisan make make controller um what's the name category so folder category and then make a controller category controller the resource all right so we have it uh let's slash 19 so get add with commits message and then put a message um post controller all right so we have a category category controller right here so let's build a route for category so this is for users right let me say users and this is for post and now we have category so we just copy we paste it and we say category g o r i yeah so when you go when you first categories are going to get category category controller and we want the same thing except for the create and edit just like that so you can create a category um yeah just like the previous ones so we save it and where's category category so yeah so just like we did for the other ones let me fix the indentation so you use shift and tab right to bring it back so yeah so index so let me just copy the code um, category very simple just like the previous ones we've been doing so categories categories and then we bring in category we say use our backslash category all right how was it index yeah so we have in this category uh, we don't need create all right so create a new category that is store so copy the same logic you build your rules name and description that's only two things we need they are both required you validate it and you create all right so you stay and let's do the last one show show a single category So find it, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, when we, when we are building the main API, we can say when you show a single category, we want to add the associated um post since category is related to post. So we can show the cat um, the related post. So we'll do that later on online. So we have category category, we just save it and then edit. We, we are not using edit, sorry. Uh, oh edit deleted and this is update so we can update a category just like we've been doing so update so first of all we need a uh, find or fail we find the id we validate and we update the update method is if you send a request inside that's all and we don't need this response json thing so i don't know we just return so the 200 is the status code so we don't need all that so we just return that and we save it so let's see if it's working actually so let's go to category so it gets categories oh so let's copy out the ui or something like that. categories 
Apple slash categories. There we go. Good. So it's working. So we have we have that. And let's let's add a category and see. So we're gonna add a category called entertainment and blah 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 blah. So we say add. And there we have it. We have one category. So let's go and see. We have it. Good. We have one category here. Good. So what again have we done? Have we done updates? We done updates. So let's check updates and category. So updates category. So we're gonna place a URL here. Oh, update category. We place a URL and category. So we're gonna update the first one, the one we just created. We go to body. We use this and. What are we updating here now? The name. Let's change the name to uh, JavaScript. We change the name to JavaScript. We change this to put. We go and then we have a JavaScript. So we go one. The name is now in JavaScript. So that is it. So let's delete a category. So just like we did for the previous ones. Let me just copy it here. So delete the indent. Oh, so um, so just copy. So everywhere the variable user is, you put category. Yeah, category. And here is category. All right. One of those in the blah 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 blah. So first category deleted. So we save it. So let's delete the one. Category one delete. Category deleted. So that is it. We're done. So we are done for a category model. So in the next stage, we're going to now deal with. Um, I think let's do comments. And we have the comments. We come in now. Deal with the relationship models. Okay. Yeah. So I'll see you in the next.